archive that we got in at Madison and Michigan. This, oh. is, this is so harmless right now. Oh, yeah. Like, it's fine. Okay, I see eggs. That's really great. Nice. So that means the queen bee is laying eggs, which means she's in here, which she means went. I caught her. I just don't know where the hell she is. Every honeybee colony at this time of year wants to swarm. And what that means is they create a few new queens. Uh, one of those queens will ultimately inherit the old hive location. And the old queen takes off with about a third of the population and seeks out a new um, location to create a new nest. I mean, I'm really happy that I just see eggs. That means that they are going to be successful. If I, if I didn't catch the queen, or if the queen died in the process, or if she died recently, then that's a little bit problematic. There's hives in various hotels downtown. They're everywhere, and they've never bothered you. They're it making doesn't... these specialized cells called swarm cells. These things. So that one. Oh, cool. This one right there. Which is how this whole process gets started, is they make new queens in those cells. for probably like 130 140 dollars mm -hmm. but at the same time like nobody paid me to go pick up those bees so it was a lot of work and a lot of time out of my day to go do that um so i'd say i broke even the individuals are part of a greater greater species or a greater like saying how it's funny that all the organs in my body get along because it's like your body is one organism but all of the microorganisms and organs and everything it's all what helps your whole person function um, but they will have enough 